Welcome to a Cosby Talk vlog. So today I'm going to go to Retro Havoc. Because for those who don't know what Retro Havoc is, it's a big car show where all cool, really, really cool classic cars come to see and meet each other. And today's one, today's particular one this year, it's at the curve, at the B2 parking lot at the curve. So I'm going to head there and see what's what. Okay, there's going to be a lot of cool cars. There's going to be a few Chabot Tambatua, I think there's going to be a big prize. The first prize of that a lucky draw is a Proton Saga. So that's going to be cool. The event is from 9am to 9pm today. I think it's just for today only. So uh, yeah, let's go and see what's in store at Retro Havoc. Sampai dekat Retro Havoc Kita dah sampai dekat The Curve Alright, so this is the first part Tu, Proton Saga tu Tu akan jadi Rasanya yang tu dah is the winning prize So, the cabutan betul is at 7.30 at night But I won't stay that long Proton Saga is an automatic, it has a thing for sound, new seats and everything, it's nice, see it's nice killer. Blue hubcaps. That we have up. And here we have something truly amazing. It's an American lanyard bus. I think... It's an Oldsmobile. Yes, it is. Oldsmobile Delta 88, I think. Yep. So it's all the same. General Motors made the same thing. So basically, in the 70s, General Motors made the same car. Each division of General Motors basically had the same car, but they had slightly different body variations. So the Oldsmobile has those weird fender flares. The Oldsmobile version of this uh, big body uh, GM car. Huge. Yeah, 98. Yeah, that's what it's called. Also wheel 98 Besar gila So yeah According to a guy I met uh, He said that it's been converted It's not the original engine Because I'm not sure if the camera can pick it up Inside there's a different gear lever It's not the column shift anymore And yeah Pillarless windows I can't see it's very dark But pillarless No pillars here It's really awesome Huge Big ass car. We have a 3 series racing Proton Saga, kinda cool. Skyline because you know you have to have a skyline. Not sure what, what version is this? It's a GTR uh, Toyota Sprinter Trueno. Really nice one actually, very very nicely done. Uh, nice seats, very nice seats inside looks pretty good. Honda Civic and a Ford Escort. Mark 1 Escort with huge fender flares. Cantik lah. Cheers, cantik gila. Gila lah. And this is only outside. So, let's go inside. So, okay, sekarang kita dah dekat tempat parking. Oh, banyak ah. So many things. Let's start over here with the Gen Gen Volvo. Gila lah. Wah. Volvo, Volvo. Ui, oh, cantik gila. Okay, so dekat sini, we have a few European cars. Mercedes SLC, Mazda or either Ford, something like that. Few uh, Corolla wagons and this. Oh, that's soon 620 pickup, tapi belakang dia kayu. So this was a trend in Malaysia back in the early 70s. It was cheaper, I think, to have the truck to have this style of bodywork. Soon 620. Awesome. Yeah, so they closed everything, all the burp into near hinges and everything, and put this wooden body on top of it. There's a bike on top. Toyota Corolla and a Mini Cooper. 
Oh, ho oh, oh, this is even cooler. It's a Honda City. Oh, these things are rare. Honda City Turbo. Yeah, this thing, this is the first Honda City, so it's a very tall hatchback thing. Oh, this is awesome. Of course, another GTR, Nissan Silvia, and a BMW 3 Series. A Corolla. So here's another interesting car. It's uh, I've seen this before. It's like it's a Volvo 144, uh, two door, it's a coupe one, but it's made to look like a hot rod. So it has these skulls, adapti semua. So yeah, this is what it looks like as these things. It's kind of cool. It's got flames and this a uh, very old, a uh, very how to say it? I'm um, sorry. Um, a first generation Mini Cooper, and this is a Mini pickup. So these are very very rare to see here because you don't see the old minis and the way you can tell an old mini is by looking at the door hinges there okay all older minis the first ones produced had these door hinges here and had no roll down windows they were slidey windows so this is a really old one and it's in awesome condition and this is the bed oh it's a slide out bed that's awesome slide out bed and everything That's awesome. Oh, okay. That's how it looked like. Oh, it's comp It's just a shell. Yeah. What's what that back place? Oh, oh, it has that thing at the back. Yeah. So and then two years of restoring everything, yeah. and now it looks like this. Yeah. It's amazing. I really like it. I really like the color and everything. <laughs> uh, no, this. you don't. Have. This one I. I added. Ah, uh, uh, okay. So it's it slides Slide out. out. Ah, okay, okay. All right. And uh, inside, is there any air conditioning, or you didn't put yeah, any? Air oh, air conditioning is. Oh, wow. Oh. Wow, it's very clean inside. Oh, it's, it's built into the car. The AC and everything. Uh, original steering wheel. Uh, door panels. So when you bought the car, basically nothing, nothing inside. Oh, wow. So everything you saw. So these parts, are they like new old stock or? Some parts are new old stock. Uh -huh. Some parts are new. Ah no, so re re remade re remade parts. Oh, you say the redo back all the old parts. Ah, that's what we get from the other Other than that, like now the steering and everything, uh -huh. it's very hard to get. Them. Yeah, because you know they don't make that that size anymore and everything. And this is the sliding window, right? So the new ones, the the door is a bit yes. thicker. Ah, okay, okay, that's how I edit this one. Very nice sliding. Very old. <laughs> all right. Ah, all right. <laughs> Oh, it's got bucket seats. Oh, oh, it's very nice inside, very roomy. Oh, this is awesome. This is an original. Oh, look how thin the steering wheel here. Super thin. Tiny pedals. It's kind of dark. So these are the switches and everything. AC, built-in AC. This is hugely awesome. Mini bolts, water, fuel is there. And MPH and KPH. Oh, awesome! Last year's awesome, gila. So that was Mr. Mani's car, okay, and everything here. Oh, let's look at that Mazda pickup truck. That is, you know, something that even Mr. Mani just now said. You know, these were these were very common back then, and they were they were very common. But you know, like I said, these are work trucks, and they are not meant to be kept. So seeing one like this in this condition is. Truly amazing, Mazda. Mazda Ute, I think that's what it's called. That's what it is, Mazda Ute. Let's look at the inside. It has a bed and everything. It has a bed liner. And uh, yeah, look at that. Original interior, I can't really see it, but the, the interior is original. So, you know, rare, very rare. You don't see trucks like this anywhere anymore. So, on the Civic. Oh. Excuse my bad camera angles. Yeah, this is on the Civic. So Sylvia, Sylvia. Oh, what's that? What is this? What is this? It's a Mitsubishi. Is it a cyborg or something? Ah, it's a Mirage. And this is a really cool 120Y. An early 120Y, an early facelift of the square, square body 120Y. There's an Iswara. Iswara Aeroback. 
lots and lots of Corollas and yep, cis Corollas, but you know these things were common. So yeah, seeing them is really cool. Mitsubishi Galant Coupe. So these were probably sold new here, but these are very hard to find nowadays. It says five speed there. This is tastefully modified. It has the correct stance and the correct wheels. Look at those wheels. Look at those wheels. Cantik sial. Sumpah semat gila. Awesome. I think this is the owner, the Chinese guy. Maybe she is packing a lot. That's awesome. Freaking cool. Okay, more BMWs is a Mitsubishi uh, Mirage Cyborg. I'm sure that's a Satria, but yeah, it's a KE7. Oh, uh, an old 90s Impreza. That's really cool. Yeah, this is awesome. It is my dream car, an A31 Zafiro. These are RB powered sedans. And this one is, well, it's built like one. Like an 80 to 31 Sephira would be completely modified. So it looks like on the inside. Yeah. That. It's all the evil gangs. Evil, evil GTR. Uh, Stagia. Very unique. Stagia is basically a Skyline station wagon. I'm sure this has the Skyline's front. GTI, cool, a real Mitsubishi Lancer, I think, convert good, <laughs> they are joking, uh, Satria, racing Satria, that's pretty cool looking as well, it's got its steering wheel hung inside, Forester, another beautifully done one, very pink Volkswagen Beetle, oh whoa, what is this? Well, it's on bags, that's for sure. And here is our friend, all his gold. His Corolla K20. Dark purple skyline. This skyline. Oh, this is all R32 skylines. Look at all of these things. Yep, R32, 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 R32. Oh, it's a whole gang of R32s. It's cool. I like. An original Proton Iswar and has neons inside. This is kind of cool. Oh, this is factory fresh. Look at this. Looks like it just came out of the showroom. Wow, you don't see these in good condition. Look at that. Here we have these Mitsubishi vans uh, and this humongous Ford Thunderbird. And next to it, <laughs> it's a tiny uh, Triumph. So you can see the size different of these two things that is people, but oh man. Man, American cars are huge. Six and a half, 6.4 liter. The top is down on this car. You can kind of see like how big it is. Like how big it is. Look at the steering wheel. And I believe it has Ford Swing Away steering wheel. Yes, it does. It has Ford Swing Away steering wheel. So you can see, the steering wheel is not straight at the moment. So I believe if you open the door and you close the door, the steering wheel will snap back into place. Okay, so the door is open. I don't, I don't want to sit. This is someone's car, you know, and COVID again. So yeah, look at that. Look at all those gauges. This was a California car according to the Retro Havoc guy. So, you know, tak ada semua. And this one lah, Ford uh, Swing Away Steering Wheel. So, kalau tarik, and ni dia akan, uh, this one lah. Let me, okay, yeah. So, you can pull this thing here. So, you can pull it. And then, you put it into gear. Bila tak masuk gear, dia akan lock the steering wheel. Look at that. Okay, you want to go in between the steering wheel. Temperature and everything. Original radio, mirror and everything. Look at that. And everything is power operated. Everything is power operated. Look, all the power window buttons are here. Top button. So that's the boom boom button. And look at that. That's the original crank there. So yeah, those are important things for the car's registration. Oh, I dropped my bag. Yep. Awesome car.
and try to close the door. Ah, oh, this is really cool. The door, the trim, and the door. Look at that, the trim and the door. So yeah, I'm gonna push this thing. Oh, it's a heavy door. It is going to put it like that. Ah. Ford Thunderbird. So big, can't even fit in my camera. Yeah, so thank you so much. So yeah, I, I've heard about the swing wheel steering wheel. But Very I mean, few people know. Yeah. <laughs> so that, that, that's free. Yeah. All right. And then when you put it in here. Ah, okay. It locks it into. Locks it, it locks itself. I see. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, back in park. Okay, but so it unlocks in park. But it came with. Yeah. So the power hood. Oh. This was revolutionary in the 60s. I think Ford was the first one to make a yes. power hard top. Yeah. Yes. And the metal metal. It came the whole galaxy. Yeah, yeah, yeah the, the galaxy. Yeah. Huge. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's where the spare wheel is. Yeah. It's um. I, I don't run the battery uh, for that. But, all right. Uh, <laughs> and this was a California car, according to it was. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. Santa Barbara. So no rust, nothing. I mean, all all pillarless. Yep. Oh, there we go. It's amazing. And even even the seats. Power seats. Back and Oh you can move the seats side to side. Yes. Yeah. That's a very weird. <laughs> it's bizarre. Yes. Very and American. It has an <laughs> FM radio which still works. Kilometers eighty thousand miles from new Fully documented, I've got a stack of documents. So, original engine, original transmission? Original engine, original transmission, man matching numbers. Oh, matching numbers, yes, yeah. matching hey. numbers. Oh, hi. Roger, nice to meet you. So many cars, the, the benefit of putting a car show in a parking lot is well, there's lots of space. Banyak gila lah. Look, park, the park parking is and the curve ni, you know, the curve ni macam dah mati tau, the Mio Mall. So, you know, banyak gila space for a big car show. Look at that, Mitsubishi Starion. That's cool. What are these things? What are these things? Look, there's still more cars. I think I know this guy's car. Uh, I have his Instagram. Uh, look at that, look at that. Hey! The mystery machine. <laughs> this is uh, this has been circulating around Facebook. This uh, mystery machine. So Toyota Light is, and it was restored. It was restored, and it was painted like this. is really nice looking. I love it. I love it so much. It's the prettiest van ever, and everything is original inside. Oh, it's so awesome. Mystery machine. <laughs> cute, ah, see a cute dealer. There it is, Toyota. <laughs> This is a row of Mazda, that's an RX-7, that's an RX-7, that's also an RX-7. 
These are either FA or FB series RX-7, that's an RX-8. This one is really cool, it has this very nice wide body, very period correct wide body. And, but I like this one the most. This is a very, very tastefully done looking uh, RX-7. It's an RX-3 I think. Yeah, that's what they call it. RX-3 and uh, yeah, it is an RX-3. There's more, more masters at the back. Let's take a look at those. Ah, uh, look at this. This is very nice looking. So Mazda's, uh, you can tell if it's a Mazda because it has this, uh, this round taillight design. So this one has it and this one has it. So yeah, this is how you tell if it's a Mazda car. So there's another row of cars here. It's a Corolla or Sprinter. Oh, it's cool. It's a K-Van. I mean K-Truck, sorry. Awesome. I think this is a Datsun pickup truck. Yes, it is. It is a Datsun pickup truck. See these vans? This is a wagon. This is also. Is it a wagon? No, it's not a wagon. But it's very nice looking. Oh, I I look over this. Is the Honda Prelude and it's in uh, really really nice condition. Look at that. That's cool. Crazy ass Brodua Cantel, I think. That was made to look like a Chevy pickup truck. This is the Benda Paling Gila. Wait, let And look at the front. Look at this. <laughs> Uh, this was in Facebook a few a few months ago, I think. Tak ingat lah, tapi memang gila lah. Look at this. <laughs> Pelik gila. Look, even has an exhaust up there. Ada motor lama. <laughs> Got the fender tutup ni. Unique lah, hasil unique gila. For true JDM guys, Nissan March Turbo. If you're a JDM guy, you really... If you watch Mighty Car Mods, uh, you would know this thing. Ah, beautiful alphas. Oh, there's three of them. The alpha spider, the coupe version of the spider, and that. I'm not sure what it's called. I think it's called the alpha suit or something. And more. It's a mini cooper. Next to it is a Julia. Oh, beautiful cars. This Julia, wow. It just looks so nice. Look at that. Next to it is a Proton Saga limousine. Also a very not not common car, so it has six doors. One, two, three, one, two, three on the other side. Look at this. These were not built, you know, in big numbers. So seeing one of this in this condition, in, in, in decent condition, is it's not very easy to find. Yo, look at the fitment on that. Ah, that is just barely lowered cars.
Okay, so that was Retro Havoc. Uh, I couldn't stay long. Even though sebenarnya sampai pukul 9. Tapi, uh, you know, I have other things to do. But, it was amazing. Banyak gila kereta. Really cool cars. Awesome cars. Classic cars. Every single kereta. Every single kereta that you want to know and you want to look at is there. Daripada kereta Jepun, kereta Europe, kereta US pun ada. So, memang best gila. So, I'm hoping that next time Retro Havoc will have more events now that, you know, uh, sekarang kita dah masuk endemic We are in the endemic uh, session I mean year We are in the endemic year of our COVID thing So hopefully there will be more events like this More retro havoc And I think later in June or July maybe Art of Speed is coming back So there's a lot in, in store uh, This year in the car community So I hope you enjoyed this uh, quick vlog And stay tuned for more content, more photos and check out our Instagram, our blog and Facebook. So thanks for watching.